We begin with breaking news tonight at 11. Police are investigating a deadly shooting outside a mosque in Upper Darby. It happened near 69th and Walnut Streets just before 8 o'clock tonight. Action News reporter Brianna Smith joins us live near the scene with what we know. Brianna. Walter, we're on Walnut Street right now outside of the Upper Dari Islamic Center. And as you can see, is still very much an active scene. There's police tape and officers investigating and evidence markers on the ground in this alleyway as they continue to try to figure out what unfolded here earlier tonight. Now, the Upper Darby Police uh, superintendent says officers responded to South 69th and Walnut Streets for a shooting just after 745. Officers found a 65 year old man shot to death in the back parking lot of the Upper Darby Islamic Center. The superintendent believes a suspect was trying to carjack the victim at that time. Soon after, officers recovered his vehicle in Cobbs Creek. Now, police have not identified the victim just yet, but residents at the scene say they are friends with him and they're in complete shock. They say he just came to the mosque this evening to pray and instead he lost his life. I just can't believe like this can happen to him uh, in such a horrible way. Uh, all I can tell is that he doesn't deserve this, he don't deserve this. I don't know who did this. I mean he has a family, he has a beautiful family. He is one of the best in our community. He always extended his hand before anybody could extend to him. He always had this smile on his face. It's a senseless act that took place here. You know, we're not sure if, if our victim was coming here to the mosque or was visiting what he was doing, but again, nobody should have to lose their life. And right now, police are investigating at two scenes. In this video, you can see officers in Cobbs Creek are searching a storm dream for evidence. And police are also looking through video to determine who the suspect or suspects are in this incident. Now, they don't have a description at this time, but police say there is no immediate threat in this area. But if you have any information about this shooting, contact police. In Upper Darby, Brianna Smith, Channel 6 Action News. Walter. Okay, Brianna, thank you.